Hi guys, so this video is um, a project share for an item that I received from BB Craft for review. Uh, so if you saw my BB Craft unboxing, you would remember that I had picked up these open bezel shapes and I will link that unboxing video down below. It has the link for BB Craft for these particular, uh, this specific set of bezels and um, definitely go and check them out. They now have free worldwide shipping, so that's great. Um, so these are what the bezels look like. They're just different shapes. If you remember, I said I picked this set because it had a, a lot of fun Halloween shapes. So I was playing around with it just to see what I could do with some glitters and some resins. And these are the ones that I created this morning, so I just wanted to share them with you. So I'll show you the regular Halloween color ones, and then I'll show you the pastelloween ones that I did. Um, let me get a white sheet of paper so I can show you how cute these look. So what I did was I used glitter and acrylic paint um, to kind of do the shading and, and the different tones. I know my lighting's not so great, but in this one I put some little Halloween googly eyes and with my label maker, I just taped out, I, I printed out a little poison label there. So I thought that was really cute. There's some little bats in there. It's like a bottle of poison. That would be really fun on a chunky charm or something. Here's another one I did. Really cute. I don't know if you can see it, but there are these little translucent little crescent moon glitter shapes in there and then there's a pumpkin and some stars and I used glitter and acrylic paint to to shade those then I started having some fun with some pastelloween ones so I'll show you this one so this one has way too much glitter in it you guys um, I went glitter crazy here but I used some sequins that I had that were ghost shaped some tiny little glitter shapes of crossbone skulls and stars and one of those Dollar Tree um, spider web confetti pieces so I thought that came out cute and it's really iridescent in the light then I did this one mostly with acrylic paints and not so much glitter um, just to see how it would look and I tried to kind of blend in the pink and the teal and the white and then I used some tiny little glitter stars I had some confetti stars and some little bats I thought that one came out really cute as well and the last one I did is see-through I really love how this one came out I'll put it against the white so you can see there's that really pretty iridescent star in the middle and then I used different color stars glitter pieces just to do a trail in the shape of the moon and I really like how this one came out this one was a little tricky because the bezel on it is sideways. I don't know if you can see that. So the way to cast these if you are going to use UV resin is to put some packaging tape underneath your resin, your um, bezel, put it down, um, sticky. put the tape sticky side up, put the bezel down on it, and then put your UV resin in and the tape will keep it from spilling out. Um, so with this one it was a little tricky. I had to play around with it, but I got it to work. And I'm wondering if I should do a layer of like the acrylic white paint on the back because that does look pretty against the white. But see-through looks really pretty as well. I just thought that would be really fun to hang off of a charm or something and it's see-through and pretty. So yeah, those are the charms that I came up with. I'm going to probably make some bow embellishments um, with this ribbon that I have here in my stash. So I'm thinking of making some like fun bows, just kind of puffy bows like this, and then hanging the um, resin piece from the middle. I should have done one to show you guys. But anyway, that's my plan for them. So um, when I do create those, I'll put a picture on Instagram. But definitely click on the link to BB Craft below if you want to check out their website. Again, free worldwide shipping. And if you want the link to these specific items, which is this box of 30 pieces of the gold-toned open bezel shapes, click on my unboxing video and it will have the link to this specific set. All right, so let me know what you guys think and do you have any ideas for how I could use these other than as embellishments or chunky charms? And yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.